What's up, K-Gang? Okay, I'm back again with another video. Today, we finna get lit. So, today, I have a voiceover for y'all, and I have a hair tutorial on how I install my wigs. This one is time to go. It's time to go. I just installed it, but it's time to go. So, today, um, I will be working with Tiny Shay Hair. Tina She Hair. Tina She Hair. That's how I don't know how to pronounce it. So, yeah awkward moment this hair is 24 inches and this is straight and the intensity is 200 i will leave a description down below this is the hair hello y'all can see y'all see that you don't see that inside of it and this is the lens you know it's dangling it's dangling but enough talking let's get to the video all right, y'all. So this story time will be about the truth, the truth of me and that, and the truth about me and Jalen. So what y'all basically really want to know is why did we break up? So me and Lynette broke up because of Jalen. Jalen was playing both sides, and y'all, when I tell y'all, I didn't know nothing about them. And what they had going on, all I knew is I love Lynette and I made a song about it, expressing my love, um, apologizing to her for the situation with Rail. I made it my decision to do that. And so that's what I did. So when she popped out with Jalen, it was like, what? Like, when did this, when did I see this coming? And then she blamed it on basically me saying that I cheated and I cheated multiple times and that's not the reason. I felt like it was more to it. I felt like she was talking to Jalen. I felt like she wanted Jalen. If y'all look at the timelines and see that when they was posting each other and stuff, I could have been more smarter. I could have, you know, was like, why are y'all posting each other so much? Why are y'all doing these TikToks together and stuff? Like, was it for the world to see that she wasn't in love with me anymore or that she wanted to be with Jalen was that the case um I didn't know at that time and I didn't I didn't want to blame her or you know accuse her of doing something when she wasn't but truly enough she was I was more hurt than anything um I don't hate Lynette um it it pretty much hurt me because it's it felt like I was portrayed it I was um lied to I was cheated on I was hurt and I never felt that because she never expressed herself. And when I expressed myself through my song, um, I basically told her that I was in love with her and that I apologized and I wanted her to accept me for the person that I was. Now the things that's going on with me and Rel, um, it's nothing going on with me and Rel. We didn't have no intention on doing that. Um, he basically kissed me himself. And yes, I did kiss back because I don't know what was going through me. But I did kiss back, and I really can't say that I would take that back because I wouldn't take it back because of the situation I'm in now. The situation that she's in a relationship with Jalen, and she's happy, and she's, like, you know, promoting him and doing this for him. And I just feel like, where is the love for me? Like, when did you ever stop loving me? We came out as fighting each other because of jay and i feel like she was playing on my top about jay yes that was my man of course but um i didn't know about her so that situation made it awkward with me and her fighting and i realized that mm, she's cute i like her i like that she can handle her own so that's what i went for and i i pretty much got her but i didn't know how to handle her i didn't i fumbled the bag yes i fumbled the bag you can say i did I had no intentions on hurting Lynette. Um, I didn't know that it would make her do this. Um, I don't have no hate towards Jalen. I just hope that he take care of her and he show her the love that she need that I couldn't give her. I felt like it was very real on my side and I feel like it was fake on her side. But then again, I don't hate her. Um, I actually applaud her for finding her somebody that can make her happy. If we're being honest, we both cheated on each other. We both was toxic. We both had things going on. We both didn't know how to talk to each other. So the internet seen the toxicness. They seen the fights. They seen the arguments. They seen the cheating. Um, but what they didn't see was the good times that we had and the bad times that we had. And I don't hate them for it. Um, like I said, I really do apologize to Lynette. And I hope that she 
can find her love and find her way with Jalen. In the future, I will be looking for somebody. I will be giving somebody else attention and I hope that she can accept my relationship also how I accept hers. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe and peace.